Episode 6, Lord of the Kachings. me please and that's the gist of super reincarnation you managed to create such a high level spell on your own you're no ordinary dog hear that Zed you should be treating me with respect worship me as the sage I am from this day forward <laughs> what sage all I see is a mangy mutt. I never imagined Cerberus to be such an incredible individual. Well, what a predicament! If Zed truly steals all my money, I'll be nothing but a worthless bum! <laughs> That's true. After all, you snore, knock things over with your gut, reek of old people, and leer like a pervert. <sighs> That was a critical hit, worthy of 9,999,999 points of emotional damage. Don't worry, you still have your one strength, Prism King. Oh, Prism Red, I expected nothing less from a defender of justice. Your words have saved this desolate heart of mine. What is this strength you speak of? My stylish facial hair? My forgiving heart? My devilishly handsome face? I'll be straight with you, Prism King. It's your wallet. Money again? Uh, every last person only speaks of my cash, my scratch, my moolah. That's how it's always been. Everyone approaches me with compliments, but in the end, all they want is a share of my wealth. When it comes down to it, I'm not a man. I'm simply a walking pile of cash. Ugh. Enemies and allies alike are only ever after my money. This is why I did not desire the throne. I wished to be a hero who fought with courage, not currency. Oh, woe that I bear the fate of being born into the royal line. There was no path but the throne for me. Oh, my. I understand exactly how you feel. I, too, am a princess by birth. I never had a chance at any other life. I might as well just be some robot programmed to seek out my happy ending over and over. It is the same for me. I live a life bound by family status and tradition. Whoa, I get what you guys mean. Even I can't think of being anything other than a prism ranger. Are all of you stupid or something? It's your life, isn't it? Live it any way you want. Cut the Mopey Protag Act and take some responsibility for yourselves. You needn't be so curt. He's right! Nobody likes a meanie, Prince Zed! <laughs> Good grief! What's with that attitude of his? How terribly offensive! 
Have you already forgotten? Zed's younger sister was killed by the God of Destruction. We still have the opportunity to fix our feelings. But for Zed, nothing in the world can bring his sister back. You're right. Prince Zed doesn't wallow in self-pity. He only focuses on avenging her death over and over again. Goodness me, how gallant. Prism Zed's been fighting so hard for so long. Our worries must seem like nothing to him. I see. Perhaps he was encouraging us to take control of our own lives. Yes, that must have been his intent. You're lucky to have found such great allies, Zed. All that's left is for you to obtain the power to defeat the God of Destruction. Where do you wish to go? By the way, who's been ruling this world while you've been gone, Prism King? Hmm. Hmm? I'm not aware of what occurred after I joined Zed in his endeavors. However, I can easily reclaim the throne with the power of money. Goodness, a gilded king, is he? I pity his poor subjects. You have my condolences. Kings like you usually end up dead. La la la, the revolution will have your head. Uh, don't kill me off so easily. I have the power of money on my side. A revolution is nothing to be feared. Rebels? 
time for my ultimate move, Monetary Compensation! <laughs> what is going on here? My, my, your majesty. They sure seem to resent you. Hey, Zed. I figured out why this revolution is happening. The consumption tax in this world recently saw a 1,200% increase. 1,200%? Whoa, you must be swimming in tax money. Hold on a moment. I've been by your side this whole time. These higher taxes are not my doing. Indeed. The one who raised them was King Yarmada. What? Hero Yarmada? My, oh my! Has someone's throne been usurped by a hero? Such a pitiful little king. <laughs> it doesn't matter who we're up against. All I'm interested in is swiping the mustache stash of cash. That'll give me the power I need to take out the God of Destruction. Come on, let's head to the castle. Follow me, please. Oh, hero Yarmada, how could you have fallen like this? <sighs> I'm sorry, Your Majesty. The God of Destruction beat me again. You needn't apologize. You're doing marvelous work, with no vacation, no bonuses, and minimal reward at that. <laughs> it's fine, Your Majesty. After all, I didn't become a hero for the riches and rewards. People believe in me. For one such as I, their smiles are the greatest reward I could ask for. Oh, hero Yarmada. You possess something wonderful, something that money could never buy. I am truly envious. If only I, too, were born a hero rather than a king. I wanted to become as strong as Hero Yarmada. I wanted the courage to stand against the God of Destruction myself without relying on the power of money. I am not but a wealthy coward, who only happened to be born royal. Forget being a hero. I'm not fit to be king. Oh, you finally get it, huh? Right now, you're not a king or a hero. You're just a mustache. Zed. Are you gonna go out a lame mustache, or will you become something more? You're the only one who can decide. I'm the only one who can decide. Is that really something I can do on my own? Yeah, of course it is. Who else is gonna do it? Uh, I see. Hmm. The decision is mine. Oh, hero Yarmada! How could you have fallen like this? Enough! I don't want to be a hero anymore! Hero Yarmada! 
what are you saying? Do you know how many times I've died? A hundred! That's ten dens! I'm sick of it! I quit! But everyone is awaiting the day you succeed. Uh, then you be the hero, your majesty! You've just been sitting on your stupid butt doing nothing! Forget it! I'm done with this! You hear me? Done! Me, a hero? If only I could. If only I had the courage and strength you once possessed. <sighs> What's wrong, Prism King? Is there something bugging you? Everyone, if I could have a moment, I'd like for all of you to tell me what is most important to you. Where exactly is this coming from? Nowhere in particular. I've merely found myself lost in the tangled woods of life. Most important? For me, it is most definitely my happy ending! My students. I want to protect them, no matter what. Mine goes without saying. It's justice! I see. What I considered most important was money. I resolved everything with it. I have never achieved anything without it. If one took money away from such a person, what would remain? Oh, definitely nothing. Your bluntness hurts, but yes. Without my riches, I would have nothing. But I wish to become strong. I want the courage Zed has to stand against the God of Destruction without money. Good grief, you sound so childish. There is no need to deny the power of money. What? She's right. Money, strength, courage. Why not have it all? I see. That had never occurred to me.